I know, this is not your favorite thing, huh? So I want you guys to know that sometimes dogs make a lot of noise that sounds scary, but they're not scary at all. I'm about to show you how that goes. So Taka's balls have been chapped a little bit. And I've been putting coconut oil on them. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. I know. Sometimes they just growl because that's just how they can communicate that they don't like what's going on. Tonka's not a whiner. So I wonder how many dogs have been deemed aggressive dogs because of that. Especially snow dogs. Because they are they're more growly than whiny. When I first started doing it, he sounded like he was going to kill me. It was way worse than that. <laughs> they actually feel they're getting a lot of <laughs> I was looking for. <laughs> They're actually getting a lot better. <laughs> yes! See, my bones are almost all healed. <laughs> I don't know if it's from the cold or what, but the, the coconut oil does wonders. <laughs> Just my babies. Just mama's babies. Damn my noisy babies, huh? If you know your dog well, then you know. Like, I know them well enough to know that they're not going to bite me. But I'm not saying all dogs are not aggressive by any means. So you should definitely be cautious, especially if you don't know the dog, huh? Yes. I would not do that to a dog I didn't know. If a dog I didn't know did that, I would say, okay, I'm going to leave you alone now. <laughs> oh, my big handsome boy.